On a jungle expedition full of glory-filled ambition, our mission took an unexpected twist. I don't know how it happened, we were following the map and then we fell into a trap obscured by mist. We'd been captured by the local tribe who had a scary silent vibe, apparently we couldn't bribe their favour. They tied us up with gags and hoods and carried us like sacks of spuds and made it it clear we were their favourite flavour. Once in their camp they sat us down and all their children gathered round to learn about the process of their food. The women were unwrapping us like new delivered packages until at last they left us in the nude. They lit a massive cooking pot and waited till it got so hot we couldn't help but sweat under its heat. That's when they started licking us and tasting us and picking us to be the flavour of a savoury treat. The cooks kept mopping up our taste, no drop of sweat would go to waste. They worked for hours while we watched on in fear. We saw the tribesmen eating lunch and gagged at what we saw them munch. A human foot, an elbow and an ear. Our worst fears had been verified as we all sat there terrified and praying for a miracle to save us. Through our tears and hopeless cries we watched with horror and surprise at the severed human limbs they came and gave us. Although we had no appetite, they forced us all to take a bite, and so my mouth was filled with half a hand. Nearly gagging as I chewed it, took a while to taste the food, but when I did, I really couldn't understand. The flavour was unusual, and though the look of it was casually created to resemble human flesh, it was obvious it wasn't meat that they were forcing us to eat, the texture was too soft and tasted fresh. Apparently, these cannibals had learnt to cook with vegetables, and made them look like things they used to eat. The whole tribe had found compassion, eating only vegan rations that they made to look and taste like human meat. Once we'd eaten lunch together and they freed us from our tethers, they returned our clothes all freshly washed and dried. Then they led us to the jungle's edge and set us free and gave us veggie fingers, thumbs and toes, all lightly fried. Well, we safely made it back to base and told our tale to every face we met, but most just laughed and walked away. But for those of us who had a taste of animals' lives that go to waste, We've all been vegan ever since that day.